Hello, what up, what's up? I'm Misha, and this is Misha C. Tarot. I hope you're doing wonderful. All praise is due to the Most High. I truly appreciate every last one of you for joining me. New subscribers, returning subscribers, and y'all that's just stopping by, if you haven't already, go on ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell. That way you'll be notified for when I upload new content. God, I thank you, Jesus. I thank you. Change the answers of the Most High with your white light. Please, God, in the purpose of the tarot and allow me to channel clear and honest messages from whomever may call this message, whatever they need to know. Related to here, Holy Spirit, clearing all those messages. For the collective, the name Stacy, really significant. I was picking up on um someone in like denial, wanting to um someone in denial. Not accepting something, all right. Um, placing it's like they want to place blame elsewhere. That's what I was picking. If they want to place blame elsewhere, something else, Holy Spirit. Somebody's unaware of something. I heard she may not know, she may not know. So somebody could be a similar as someone is aware of something and she may not know. <laughs> she may not know. I, um, yeah, I just got that little laughter because my favorite character, I was just talking about this movie in a, one of the last videos I just did. My favorite character, uh, what was her name? Cecilia Foot from the help. It's in between Minnie and Cecilia Foot. I just I can't decide between them two. They're like <laughs> they they support each other's roles very well in that movie. But Miss Cecilia Foot, that that woman was my favorite character. All right. And uh I was just thinking about when um she shitted in that pie and that lady ate that pie and she assumed that Cecilia Foot knew that she ate the uh the shitty pie because she uh at the auction she bought her a pie and it was like just this inside joke and she assumed that she ate the pie but yeah it's just like Cecilia Foot didn't know anything about that so Minnie had to tell Cecilia Foot like what was it about so it's like she didn't know maybe she didn't know like Cecilia Foot didn't know that Minnie had put shit in that lady's pie so when Cecilia Foot bought that lady a pie and Minnie started working for Cecilia Foot that lady just assumed that they was in cahoots and uh Cecilia didn't know anything she was just just a ball of life just a sweetheart but um anyways let's get into this message We out here judgment and forgiveness at the bottom of the day. Yeah, I'm just getting that. We have here, I understand that everyone has their own unique path and challenges. I acknowledge that harboring resentment blocks the flow of love. What else? Fear? Balance? I realize that I'm testing my resolve to live in the energy of love. I bring a state of perfect harmony into my world, and I do so with judgment. Judgment is here twice. At the bottom of the deck, we have discipline. Somebody was in fear of something. So it's like they made a move to call judgment on the situation. Give me one more with the spirit. Yeah, we have your peace coming out with success. So somebody found some peace within a situation. Yeah, there was some type of balance brought to a situation after this judgment was called. Fear is very significant. Fear is not of the most high. And somebody was in fear of something. Or someone. What is this, Holy Spirit? Three of Swords with the King of Wands in the day. So if I fear. That is a lot. Okay. 
have here the Four of Wands and the Seven of Cups. Yeah, somebody had all these different um, assumptions about someone or something. I don't know what this is. I know this has something to do with a connection, though. Somebody was in fear of something. Okay, what, what what's going on? Yeah, the Seven of Swords flew out with the Ace of Cups. Okay, so somebody could assume that somebody was given to more than one person. Or somebody was not being truthful. Clarify the four wands here with the Ace with the Ace of Swords. I just finna say the Ace of Swords, not the Ace of Swords out here. Clarify the Seven of Swords, Holy Spirit, four wands. You have the Sun card falling out with the King of Cups, the Death card. Somebody, huh, somebody was getting ready to end something with somebody, or they ended something with somebody because they thought somebody was dealing had dealings with someone else. And they weren't. They weren't. Somebody sabotaged your connection. They played themselves. Now they want to bring balance to the situation. Clarify balance and judgment by the spirit. Yeah, the three of wands coming out here with the eight of swords. The nine of swords. Somebody. Somebody. It's like, I don't want to say embarrassed, but uh, shame. They just be feeling shameful. The type of thoughts that they were having about you. Because I feel like this person wasn't having good thoughts. We have here peace. I am. I am. Being the, I am a being of love and I release all negative energy. But we also have your fear. I realize that I am testing my resolve to live in the energy of love. What about the Eight of Swords, Three of Wands, Holy Spirit? Balance and judgment. So somebody still feels like there's some type of hope for this connection. Like, I don't know, like they want to come back to somebody or they it's like they never even left. Like they never even let this person go. But there's the thoughts that they were having about this person weren't too good. They thought this person was fucking around. Giving to another person. Yeah, the Ace of Pentacles here with the Five of Cups. Somebody said, yeah, the Three of Pentacles is showing itself, but it's in reverse. It's like somebody's like, I'm not fucking around with you. Like, I'm not giving it to no one else. Like, you're the only one. And I'm this is kind of, I'm getting irritated. <laughs> I don't know why. I'm getting irritated. So I just, I feel like this person's, yeah, Eight of Cups. We have here the Princess of Pentacles, the Eight of Cups, the Three of Cups. The Ten of Pentacles with Three of Pentacles in reverse. So they could be worried about a, a friend that's around their person, okay? And I'm also getting, too, that somebody that's just a friend, they could be assuming, like, they fucked around with this person, but, like, no. They're not even sexually attracted to this person. Like, this person just literally, literally their friend. Like, they just got a connection like that. They just vibe out like that. Like, they don't they don't want each other. They're not interested in each other at all. Or then this person's not interested in anyone at all like they're just they want to be with you and as i was saying about that me getting irritated is because i don't feel like this person is doing anything to this king of cups energy that makes this person feel like they're giving to someone else i feel like this is all of what's going on in this person's head like somebody's creating creating scenarios in their own fucking head about what somebody could be doing behind their back fear Judgment. Mr. Judging a person. But with this Ace of Pentacles and a Five of Cups, like somebody's overthinking something, like for real. I, somebody really, really thought someone was giving to someone else. I split the deck with the Ace of Cups, Princess of Cups, Princess of Pentacles, and the Princess of Cups. So somebody could feel like somebody is the total opposite of them, but they could see this person as competition. Or it's just like I don't know. It's 
the idea of someone knowing that someone could potentially be a good partner for you, but you're not interested in this person, but the person that you're interested in is noticing that somebody around you could potentially be a good partner to you. Yeah, the seven of wands here. But I'm getting like this person that they're um, calling this, they're just sitting back and judging here. It's like the opposite of them in some kind of way. And they're a really good, decent, they're like they're a decent person. The star card is showing this up. They're just like, they're in fear that something's going to end with you guys because of someone else. Like, they're in fear of someone else coming in between you guys. The Six of Pentacles with the Death card. What is this? Peace? Because there is peace brought to a situation. Ace of Pentacles. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, Five of Cups. We have here the Seven of Pentacles with the Five of Pentacles going into reverse. We have here the Five of Pentacles, Five of Cups, Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles. And that's what I'm saying. It was the uh, princess of cups and then the princess of pentacles. Wow. Somebody is turning purple in the face, trying to convince someone you shouldn't have to do this. Trying to convince someone like, I don't want them. I don't care what they got to offer. I want you. I, why Why? can't you see it? I need you to see that. This person has like major insecurities, self-doubt. All right. I'm getting like low self-esteem or they don't have very much confidence or they have no way of boosting their own self-confidence. They're always looking for validation from other people. This person has a lot of self-work to do. I mean, I'm. I don't know. It's like somebody like what? Else, what? What else can you do? What else can you say? Yeah, the King of Swords here with the Temperance. I feel like both of you two want to bring balance to a situation. The Ace of Swords behind the Temperance. That's the truth. But it's like y'all just stuck, blank face, dumbfounded, like looking at each other. Like, okay, well, what now? King of Wands, King of Swords, the Star card, the Lovers card, Judgment once again. Mm -hmm. At this point, let me get one more message on the spirit advice to throw this out. Because they don't know how any other way to reassure the person or to express or to elaborate on the fact that they don't know nobody else but them. What is these three? We have here worry, love, and imagination. I can't make it up. Like, I don't know what's going on in this person's head. And somebody's imagination is driving them wild of what maybe could be. Maybe, could be, what if? This has something to do with a, a love situation, okay? Somebody's in worried and in fear. Feel like balance needs to be brought to a situation. Feel like balance has to be brought to a situation. Because you guys can't go on like this. Somebody can't go on like this. I'm going to um, leave it right there, you guys. I'm sending you the utmost love and respect, peace, healing, joy, prosperity, abundance, love, and hell that shit. Peace.